girl, we getting faded over here. We made it over here. We keep this on it's Rita. Thank you so much for coming back to my channel. If you are new to my channel, then go ahead and subscribe so you never miss an upload from me. And if you've been rocking with me for a minute, you already know what to do. Hit that like button and then comment down below what you thought about the video. If you want to see what I got in this month's subscription from BoxyCharm, then of course, just keep watching. Okay, you guys. So the BoxyCharm comes in this little box right here. It is a monthly subscription. So this monthly subscription, what they send is a lot of beauty products, they send makeup items, and then they also send things for your skin because skin is very important in makeup. One of the things that I preach the most about is to have a flawless foundation is to make sure that you take care of your skin. So it only makes sense that they add skincare products in with makeup products. Without further ado, because I don't wanna do no rambling, let's just go ahead and jump right into the box. Of course, they put these little postcards in the box, and the postcard just pretty much tells you all of their social media, um, how you can reach them if you need help, how to get a box, etc., etc. And then on the back is the part that I absolutely love, what this does on the back is it tells you each product that you've gotten in the box for the month. It tells you the product and it also lists what the product retails for. So if you were to go out like to a store or go online, this is pretty much the price range that you would pay for each product. And then it tells you details about what the product is supposed to do as far as it's concerned. First thing that they have listed here is from Pure. This is their Sculptor palette. It says that there are four shades, sculpting palettes that features two high beam highlighters and two matte contour shades that will leave your skin sculpted to perfection, highly pigmented and buttery formulas. So again, it's this silver little packet. So those are the two contour shades, which I absolutely love because I know that I'll be able to use those shades because they look like the shades that I contour with. And then of course, these are the highlight shades. I actually love that it has a mirror in this compact because a lot of times when you get, you know, palettes like this, there's no mirror. So if you need to touch up your makeup while you're on the go, or if you need to do like a quick mini light beat, you really can't because, hey, <laughs> she cute. There's no mirror for you to actually put your face on and, you know, do your application and everything. So I love that this is small, compact, and it has a mirror on it. This palette actually retails for $30. It also tells you what hashtags you should use in the event that you want to take pictures and like post pictures or you want to show that you're using the products or that you like the products. I think for $30, because it's pure, this is a good deal. So the second thing that was in the box that I'm actually excited about is from one of my favorite brands, which is Cover FX. It is their Blurring Primer. Is lightweight, soft focus primer that blurs the appearance of pores, fine lines, and other imperfections. It creates a smooth canvas for flawless foundation application. I can't stress enough, you guys, how important it is to use a primer before you do your makeup. It will make a world of difference, I promise you. So if you haven't been priming your face, you should. My girl Nitra B say it is a crime not to prime. So you need to be priming your face. I'm excited about this because I have been looking at this primer for quite some time and I just wasn't sure because I have so many other primers that I use that work for me. But this is one that I've wanted to try so I'm really excited that they decided to put this in this month's box. This primer does retail for $38. I know that sounds like a lot but you have to understand that Cover X uh, FX is really a good brand and they do make quality products. I'm actually just going to test a little bit of this out. I did put a little bit on my skin and it came out like this almost brownish nude color. Um, but when I rub it in, it, it really does feel good. Like I have normal to dry skin. So for me, when I have a product like this, like I'm rubbing it in now, it doesn't, it doesn't feel too oily. I do feel the conditioner or like the, the vitamin E a little bit, but it's not overbearing. And it does make my skin feel really soft and satin like. So anytime that I can get a primer that does this for me and I'm just using it on my hands, I know that it'll do wonders for my face. The next thing um, is from Pretty Vulgar. I haven't heard of them before, but I already like them because this is just super cute, y'all. 
Like, it looks like one of those little ink cartridges that they used to use back in the day to um, write their names and stuff. That's just dope. This is their highly pigmented gel eyeliner. It says that it has vitamin C and conditions the lids, and it's creamy, waterproof, hello and this actually retails for 24 dollars i just love this little thingy this is so cute i don't have a lot of gel liners i for me when it comes to liners i stick to what i know works i usually don't go outside the box the fact that this is waterproof and it's a cream or a gel um liner i actually love so i will be trying this out and i'll let you guys know what i think about it Next items that were in here, I'm just gonna do all of these at once because they're all from the same brand, it looks like. They put in four brushes. Now, y'all know, makeup brushes cost. The fact that they put makeup brushes in this box, I absolutely love. The three-piece eye trio, which are these three that I'm holding right now, one is an angled eyeliner brush, the other one of course is a spoolie, and then the other one is a fine tipped eyeliner brush. So I would probably use the fine tipped eyeliner brush probably as a lip liner, like a lip pencil or a lip brush. Um, and then I would definitely use this, this uh, angled brush probably as a duo, maybe for my brows and for my eyeliner. Sometimes you can do that with brushes, like if the brushes are good brushes and they're quality, you can switch them up and make them be for different things or use them for like different types of uh, makeup app applications. They have this face brush, it's supposed to be synthetic, but y'all from the feel of it, like, this feels like an angel wing. Yeah, it feels like the wings of an angel. If an angel felt like anything, it would feel like this. The face brush costs $27, that's what it normally retails for. And then those trio, the three that I showed you, retails for $45 together because it's a trio and then the last thing that i absolutely love is they included another lippy so i get to try another lippy and i'm so excited about that because look at the color if y'all know me y'all know that i live for like nude and natural looks i don't believe that you have to like put on a bunch of makeup to make yourself look prettier or look more beautiful i just like natural but then i do have times where like i go you know all out like this look right here okay she did that, snatched. Anyway, I do like to keep it light and flirty sometimes, so I love this color. This is by Beauty Creations. This is in the shade Sweetheart. I will swatch it for you guys. This is their Longwear Matte Lip Gloss. That is what it looks like. So, you know, just like a kind of blush, but still nudish pink kind of color. It does have a little red in it, but I like it. I like it a lot. All of those items for that box totally retails for $174, y'all. That's more money than you got in your child support check this month. It's $174 and you only paying $21 a month for the box. Like, I'm not no mathematician, but sis, what you waiting on? Get the Ipsy subscription on your own, child. I'm gonna stick with Boxy Charm. That's that's where I'm at. That was it for the box. If you like this video and you want to see more videos like this, then you already know what to do. Give this video a big thumbs up because if you don't give it a thumbs up, then I feel like you low key hate me. Why? You don't want me to be great? You don't do that. I love you guys. Thank you so much for supporting me. Thank you for just spending some time with me and getting through this video with me. If you guys want to see how I achieve this look that I have on right now, I will definitely link the tutorial below or I'll put it somewhere like in the description box and you can go and check out that tutorial later on. But as always, I love you guys. Choose life and I will see you in the next video. Peace.